I am here with Melissa. Yes. Hi. Now, I thought, I thought that I would be saying Melissa, Canada's favorite dancer. Aww. Did you think that too? You know what? Um, in a way, I did just because I did so well. Like on the show, I've gotten like you know standing ovations every time. So yeah, I had an inkling that maybe I would get it, but I wasn't banking on it just because. You never know. Like it, it doesn't necessarily. It's it's the favorite, right? So I just, to be honest, I'm I'm really happy. Like, do you think that like the judges giving you standing ovation after standing ovation, which I have never seen on any other ever ever, do you think that that helped or hurt you? Like you, it, you know, like at first I was like, you know, maybe Canada thinks that she's going to be safe, so they're not going to vote. Or maybe they think that like you know they don't need to vote because everybody else is. So do you think yeah. that it helped or hurt? Um, I think that, to be honest, getting, I think it helped just because it made me want to work that much harder to get another one. You know what I mean? So, um, it helped in a way. Um, actually, yeah. No, it did help. Sorry, I was trying to... Yeah, yeah. No, I mean, it did help. It helped me a lot. The thing about these competition shows, American Idol, So You Think You Can Dance, they always say that it's like girls voting for the cutest guy. But I feel like the last two dance shows, like So You Think You Can Dance Canada and the US version, it was, you know, it came down two girls on both, right? So isn't that, do you think that that's proving that it's not just like girls voting for guys anymore? Um, yeah, well, I mean, if it, it's, it's a dance show, and to be honest, there's a lot of girl right. dancers yep. out there, right? So, um, I think that, you know, in a way, we're, we're inspirations for the girls because they can relate to us more. Right. Because, you know, there's a lot of things that, you know, guys are so powerful and they're so yeah. strong. And, I mean, we're doing duets all the time and they're basically, like, lifting us up. And then, you know, like, it's just, it's different in that sense. And, um... I just, I feel like, yeah, girls are just, they can relate to girls more, so they understand. And do you think that the show is sort of like, I remember the first season of this show, Nico would come out and like, you knew, like everybody was knew from like the first insane. week, everybody was going insane, <laughs> and like, I feel like the show and its audience has really progressed, because now yeah. it's not just about like, you know, who looks the best, or who can yes. write the most words on their chest, like Nico used to do, it's about like the best dancer, do you feel the same way? I do feel the same way. <laughs> Um, just over the years in general, like, I feel dance has been so much more exposed, and it's with help from this show, mm -hmm. because, I mean, before this, it was like, really, people were like, oh, you dance? Oh, okay. And, you know, and they don't really appreciate, like, the art and the physicality that goes into it, mm -hmm. and just from, yeah, just being more exposed yeah, to totally, dance totally. In, in a lot of ways, on TV, on, in movies, in music, mm -hmm. like, every single movie video now you see it's you got dancers in the True. background you know so um just being more exposed to it i think that now they can maybe differentiate or something you know or like see what they like better or you know what i mean um you know i was when when i was in school i was i had a really hard time figuring out like what i wanted to do you know do i want to yeah. be a lawyer do i want to be a doctor do i want to be a reporter and you know it came down to reporter and professional dancer and you know why i decided to go with the reporting and not the dancing why because i didn't want to wear those like outfits i'm like i'm just too self-conscious you know yeah i could not i could not pull the matt mar i could not pull you know i could not just like do the adam and just like rip it off and you know so do you ever get used to that you know do you um to be honest yeah because growing up and doing dance competitions i mean that's what you wear mm -hmm. you know um because and, and a lot of it has to do with the physicality that goes into dancing right. because you can't wear loose clothing and spin a million times your dress is gonna go in your face you but you never feel uncomfortable your... like you don't even know it. like it's like oh my gosh how is she doing that with that guy she didn't even know him three months ago you know well yes and, and that's another part in it that goes with dancing i mm -hmm. think it's it's yeah it's artistic and it's physical but it's also acting like it's it has everything in it, right, you know, right. like, you need your musicality there, you need your strength, you need your, your technique behind it, and you also need your performance, and performance is acting, so. Now, my, here's my final question. Yeah. You know, when you taught me how to do that, like, the dance move, like, you remember? Tell me you remember. Oh like, I remember. Okay. What move did I teach you, though? Well, it was, like, the entrance, and I couldn't find the mark, and it was a total disaster, oh, and then yeah. I did my freestyle, just to refresh your memory. Yes, Okay. Yes. Here's the thing, here's the thing that I'm wondering. 
At that time, you know, you had just met me. You have to be nice. You have to give me the, oh, hey, I don't know him. Let's be nice. Now that some time has passed, I want your true report card. Like, how, how bad was uh -oh. it, Melissa? Okay. Oh, you can be Hurts. honest. I can take it. I can take Hurts. it. Okay, I can take it. I'm just going to say that I can give you a couple of lessons. You know what? I was pulling for you the whole time over Jordan. Gone. No, I'm glad Jordan won. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So what's next for you? I don't know. Honestly, I, I just, I just want to dance and do anything that I can, and whether it's in Canada or it's in the States or it's wherever. I just, I love everything. I love doing everything. It's not like a set path for me, just because I love contemporary, but I love salsa, but I love hip hop, gotcha. but I love. I love too many things, so... That's I'm like just, me and the girls who say that you can dance Canada. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I love exactly. them all. Exactly. All right. Thank you all so right, much. Mert. All right, take care. So nice to see you Her again. dad loves me. Her he, dad was he just does. going on and on about Mertz outside. He was just, he was screaming and he's like, you know... This relationship bloomed behind my back. I don't he, even know. He, I was just like, you know, man, congratulations. Your daughter just finished second. He's like, Mertz, oh my God, I read it every week. The dance lesson was amazing. So, you know, I think... I think we're like this, you know. We are, you guys. Are. Yeah. Well, we, we're I gonna be. We're gonna be like. Well, this I don't know. I don't like your whole lessons. like dance we're lessons, gonna, like, you know. Okay.